So primarily, I will talk about the cyber battlefield. That's what it has become now. It's no longer an IT problem or a business problem or a work problem or a home problem. You know, it's just pretty much a, a constant battle uh, that we live in in this space. How to secure the computers, the servers, the communication, and how do we go about authenticating and authorizing the person that is operating on the network? What are five edge devices, how they have changed shape, and how to go about conducting a forensic analysis, how to recover from a disaster, and, I, and I'll touch a little bit on, on, on mobile uh, security as we go along. So here's what happens in a minute on the internet. And this data is 20, 2018 early data. So the number of applications under on the internet is phenomenally growing every day. And we download these apps, and they go on the internet, and then we, we pretty much uh, go and use all of them. So we're looking at about 5 million hit in Google per minute. And you know, multiply that, and, and the effects of that data moving along. <clears throat> So close to you know, 10 to 100 petabytes of data is moved across the internet, and we're all part of it as we go clicking through that. So let's take a look at the cyber battlefield. There's a, there's a long list here, laundry list. I'll touch up on the ones um, that will leave an impression on your mind. So if we go through it, the primary purpose is you know, critical business security. So that is somebody attacking your infrastructure to stop you from working. So when you, when you use your device, use an application to talk to something else out there that gives you data and information, you know, the corruption that can happen or the denial that can happen could emerge from any one of these layers in the architecture. So data becomes the new commodity that can make or break. So protecting this data is not just putting an encryption lock on it. It's protecting the various layers on the internet where the data is produced and making sure that things are secure. 